What's going on, everybody? Crazy Dog back for another video. And this video will be my 2018 NHL Stanley Cup playoffs predictions. And it's time for me to reveal who I think will be bringing home the Lord Stanley Trophy this year. Will it be the Pittsburgh Penguins for a third straight year? Well, have to wait and see. So anyways, uh, I'm going to try and get through these as quickly as possible. I'm not trying to have this video going into the 20 to 30 minute mark. Although if I really wanted to, I could literally talk about each matchup forever. But I'm not going to do that. I'm going to try and get through these as quickly as possible. So without further delay, let's get right to it. Starting in the Western Conference with the number one seeded President's Trophy winner, Nashville Predators, who finished the regular season at 53, 18, and 11 with 117 points as they go up against the Colorado Avalanche, who finished the regular season at 43, 30, and 9 with 95 points. And during the regular season series, the Predators swept the Avalanche four games to nothing. And to be completely honest, I see nothing changing from the regular season. I mean, the Predators could easily sweep them again. But I'm, okay. I'm going to be nice. I'm going to be nice to the Avalanche. And I'm going to give them one game. Yeah. I have the Predators winning in five games over the Avalanche. Moving on to the next round. And who will they face? Well, it'll either be the Winnipeg Jets, who finished at 52, 20, and 10 with 114 points, or the Minnesota Wild, who finished 45, 26, and 11 with 101 points. And in the regular season series, the Jets took it three games to one. I mean, the Wild are not a bad team, but... The Winnipeg Jets are just that much better. So give me the Winnipeg Jets winning this series in six. So we got Nashville versus Winnipeg. That's going to be a really, really good matchup, especially at the goalie position. Where you're going to have Pecorine versus Hellebuck. Whew, two of the best goalies in the league facing off. That's going to be a good one. Now, as for the other two matchups in the West... We got the Vegas Golden Knights, who have had the best regular season by an expansion franchise since the 90s Panthers, as they finished 51-24-7 with 109 points, and they will face off against the Los Angeles Kings, who finished 45-29-8 with 98 points. And uh, in the regular season series, they actually tied. Two, one, and one. So that's impressive. And I think this series will go the distance. I have the Vegas Golden Knights winning in seven games. And who will they face? It will either be the Anaheim Ducks, who finished 44, 25, and 13 with 101 points, or the San Jose Sharks, who finished at 45, 27, and 10 with 100 points. And during the regular season series, the Sharks took the series 3-0-1. And in fact, uh, three of the four games went to shootout. And the Sharks took two of the three shootout games. And then they uh, dominated the third game 6-2. to two. So uh, this is going to be a fun series. I see this one also going the distance. I have the Ducks... Winning in seven. So there you go. So in the Western Conference semifinals, we got the Predators and the Jets, the Knights and the Ducks. Sounds cool, doesn't it? Now moving on to the Eastern Conference. Number one seeded Tampa Bay Lightning, who finished the season at 54, 23, and 5 with 113 points. Going up against the New Jersey Devils, who finished 44-29-9 with 97 points. And wouldn't you believe it, the Devils 
took the regular season series three games to nothing. Damn. Talk about having their number. But unfortunately for the Devils, I got the Lightning winning this in six. So I got the Tampa Bay Lightning moving on to the Eastern Conference semifinals. Now, who will they face? It will either be the Boston Bruins or the Toronto Maple Leafs. Boston finished the regular season 50, 20, and 12 with 112 points. And Toronto finished 49, 26, and 7 with 105 points. And the Maple Leafs took the regular season series three games to one. And I see nothing changing. I see Toronto taking this uh, series, I'm going to say in six. So uh, give me the Toronto Maple Leafs to face off against the Tampa Bay Lightning in round two. Now in the next matchup, we got the Washington Capitals who finished the regular season at 49, 26, and 7 with 105 points going up against my beloved Columbus Blue Jackets who finished the regular season at 45, 30, and 7 and 97 points. And the Capitals took the season series three games to one. I mean, Columbus has been one of the most inconsistent teams at times, but then... At other times, they've been really dominant. And I think Columbus uh, could get hot at the right time. Don't sleep on the Blue Jackets, let me just say. But uh, Washington's reputation for choking in the playoffs, I mean, it's too much to pass up. Give me the Blue Jackets to win this series in seven games. Moving on to face either the Pittsburgh Penguins, who finished 47-29-6 with 100 points, or the Philadelphia Flyers, who finished 42, 26, and 14 with 98 points. And the Penguins swept the regular season series four games to nothing. And uh, I know Philadelphia Flyers fans and Philadelphia sports fans in general are feeling high right now because the Eagles won the Super Bowl. And now all of a sudden they think all their sports teams are going to all of a sudden make title runs. Well, uh, that stops here because I have the Penguins advancing into the next round, winning in seven games against the Flyers. I know one thing about this series. There's going to be a lot of fights, and uh, get your popcorn ready. It's going to be fun to watch. It's going to be a bloodbath. I mean, damn. These two teams epically hate each other. Like, I thought Columbus and Pittsburgh hated each other. <laughs> Nothing compared to the hatred between Pittsburgh and Philly, let me tell you. So yeah, I got Pittsburgh advancing to the next round. Moving on to the semifinals, we got in the West, we got the Predators and the Jets. This is going to be one hell of a matchup. Um, I'm going to have to go with the Winnipeg Jets getting the win. I think they're going to eke it out in seven games over the Predators. I know people are going to be shocked that I said that, but hey, Winnipeg is a very, very good team. Don't sleep on them. I got them uh, being slightly better than the Predators. In fact, I'll go an inch further and say the Jets are going to win it in a shootout. Yeah, I'm being that bold. So I got the Jets advancing to the Western Conference Finals. Now, who will they face? Well, it'll either be the Vegas Golden Knights or the Anaheim Ducks. And I think the new boys in town are going to keep on rolling. I got the Vegas Golden Knights beating the Anaheim Ducks in six games. So in the Western Conference Finals, we got the Vegas Golden Knights and the Winnipeg Jets. Now in the Eastern Conference we got the Tampa Bay Lightning and the Toronto Maple Leafs. I think Tampa Bay is going to take care of business. I got the Lightning winning in six games over the Maple Leafs. They're just too good. And uh, I got the Pittsburgh Penguins beating my Blue Jackets in seven games. I mean, it's no secret. They epically own us. And... I don't know if we're ever going to beat them in the playoffs, for real. But uh, I got the Penguins advancing to face the Lightning. So, in uh, the Stanley Cup Final, I got, get this, the Vegas Golden Knights going up against 
the Tampa Bay Lightning. I got the Knights beating the Jets in seven and the Lightning beating the Penguins in six. Now, who's going to be the Stanley Cup champion? Sorry, Vegas. I'm going to roll with the Lightning to win the Stanley Cup this year. So, uh, yeah, the so-called Golden State Warriors of the NHL, they get a stand. They bring home Stanley Cup, the, the Lord Stanley Trophy. So that's going to do it for this video. My predictions are probably going to be wrong, but, hey, you know, at least I uh, made this video. Look back at it uh, after the season's over and see how I did. So that's going to do it for this video. I'm Crazy Dog 99 and I will see you for my Capitals and Blue Jackets preview, which will be coming out probably tomorrow. So I'll keep an eye out for that. But until then, I'm Crazy Dog. Let's go, Browns. I'm out.